Very good evening, my name is Paul Beck, welcome to Bit.TV. Tonight, as you can see, I'm in the kitchen, and the reason for that is because most of the articles that we're auctioning off this evening are from the kitchen. We've got saucepans, we've got kettles, we've got toasters, we've got microwave ovens, we've got cutlery, we've got all sorts of kitchenware. Now, not only are we specialising on kitchen goods this evening, this month is our mega price drop month, so don't forget that any time the auction could drop to as little as one pound. Keep your eyes open, keep your ears peeled, Watch out for the price drop, it could go to as little as a pound. The first article we've got this evening is a set of four pans. These four saucepans are made from a special material, it is known as titanium alloy. Now you're probably sitting at home saying, what the hell is titanium alloy? Believe me, I was saying exactly the same until I got the, the instructions about this material. It is really a marvellous, in fact, it's ingenious. And these are normally very, very expensive pans. You can see the starting price was £150. I expect it to drop to a lot less than £140. Uh, but titanium alloy is a fantastic idea. This material is actually used on the space shuttle. It is what protects the shuttle from the heat as it goes in and out of the atmosphere. Now, the reason that they've started to make the pans out of these is because it really encapsulates the heat. It gives a great opportunity to cook the vegetables very quickly and very efficiently. Now, you might notice by looking at this that it's actually a lot shallower than your normal pots and pans. And the reason for that is you just put a little bit of water in, about a centimetre of water, say three quarters of an inch. You put the lid back on, all four pans come with the lid, and then it steam cooks anything inside it. It's a fantastic idea. Now, of course, you could use it just like this. Like, this is a milk pan. If you just want to heat up your milk for your hot chocolate or your Horlicks at night, then you can do so. But if you're cooking vegetables in them, put a little bit of water, put that lid on, and then you can cook great, great veg. Now, for example, if you just cook for a few minutes, let's say 25 minutes, you have got fabulous crunchy carrots. If you don't like crunchy veg, and to be honest, I'm a big, big fan of crunches, but if you don't like crunchy veg, you just cook for a little bit longer and it will make your vegetables soft, okay? Now, sprouts, it doesn't matter whether you cook them for a long time or a short time, I'm not gonna eat them. Sprouts, forget it, they're out the window. I ain't eating sprouts. So this is your first one, ladies and gentlemen. Now, the very, very important part is on the bottom. On the bottom of the Miracle Made pots and pans, titanium alloy, you come with this thermal radial base. It is five millimeters thick, and the important part are two things, actually, two things that are very, very important about that. First of all, it ensures that the heat is evenly distributed across the pan. Now, if you're like me, if you're a big baked beans lover, and I'm not a great cook, so I have to cook things like baked beans, spaghetti, ravioli, whatever is easy. The great thing about that is while you're stirring it with your wooden spoon, and you've got to have a wooden spoon, don't use a metal one, and I'm not telling you, that's not the, uh, the manufacturers telling me to tell you that, that's Cub Scouts. I learned that in Cub Scouts. You've got to use a wooden spoon on your metal pans. Don't put metal on metal. The other thing I learned at Cub Scouts is on my big toast, you've got to cut a little V. Cut a V in your toenail, you'll never get in growing toenails. But you might not want to hear about that. So let's get back to the pots and pans. Very important, you put a little bit of water in there, you can steam cook your vegetables. Evenly distributed heat means that you can ensure whilst you're stirring your baked beans that they are all cooked. You don't want to pour them out, get them onto your toast, you're eating away your beans on toast, suddenly you've got a beautiful hot mouthful of beans and then the next thing you know you've got a horrible cold mouthful of beans. With these pans you won't get that, the heat is evenly distributed across the bottom. The other great thing about that is that it makes them more efficient so we can actually save you money on your bills. Whether you're using gas or electricity, because it's more efficient you won't have to cook for as long and you will save money on your bills. Now all of the pots and pans also come with these heat resistant handles. They are stay cool handles. You get them on the pan itself and on the lid. This one we're looking at right now is the seven, uh, seven inches, I almost said centimeters then, that's a lot shorter, seven inches and it's got one liter capacity. Our second pan also comes with the lid. Again, stay cool handles, got the radial base. Uh, this is eight inches and it's got one and a half liters. Moving up to the nine inches with two liter capacity, you'll see that because that's a little heavier, you might have more veg in there, a little bit more water in there. It's actually got two stay cool handles. All of these also come with four layers of non-stick tar. Non-stick, so it doesn't matter what you're using in there, whether you're cooking eggs, scrambling eggs, you might scramble eggs. I've scrambled eggs myself, and I, I, I think I've told you girls, I've told you before in another program, I am a terrible cook. I'm no good. When I went to uni, the only three things that I learned to cook was rice, macaroni cheese, and pasta. Now the only one that I got really, really proficient at was the rice. And that can stick if you're not careful. Rice can stick, 
if you're not careful. But I've learned to be careful. I've got a nice balance now. I know exactly the amount of water to put in. I know exactly how long to keep it going. But I moved on from there. I actually went and got a wok. Then I throw my wine, rice in, the, in my wok. I throw my rice in a wok. And I make a wonderful meal. So I wok it anyway. You don't care what I can cook. Let's get back to it. This is nine inches. It also comes from a lid. Then we move on to the fourth one, the largest one. Now that's a big one. And the reason for that is that this actually is for your casseroles. You can throw a little chicken in there. You can throw your beef in there. You can make great soups in there. This is your good casserole dish maker. Now, if you're looking at this thing, and that's a great deal on the cushion, you see the price has gone from 150 it's already down to £85 now, and still dropping, so it's not over. If you would like to make a bid, please give us a call on the number at the top of the screen, that's 0901. 201 201 one. Very, very simple. Three things you need to make a bid. First of all, you do need to be 18 years of age or older. You've got to have a telephone. If you don't have a phone, you can't call us. And the third and finally, you do need to have a major debit or credit card. Now, when you call us, if this is the first time you've bid, don't be concerned. Don't think, oh, they're going to ask me lots of questions. That's not the case at all. In fact, it's just a recording. You do not need to listen to the recording. Simply hit one on your keypad and hang up. 20 to 30 minutes later, we'll call you back. We'll take the information information from you. If you're a regular buyer from us, then we'll already recognize your telephone number, we'll know all your details, and we'll simply get the goods out to you. They'll be with you within seven to ten days. Now, for those of you that are watching for the first time, if you say, well, I don't know, I've never bought from BidUp, it's a big investment. 150 quid, which was the starting price, is a big investment. We're already down now. Look at that. The price is dropping down to 48 pounds and still going. That is not a big investment, but we do care. We really, really are so that we want to make sure that you love what you get and if you don't love it then you've got the opportunity to send it back to us you have 14 days if you're not 100% satisfied with these you've got 14 days to get them back and you get 100% guaranteed money back now you've got to bear in mind these are going pretty quickly we started with 200 pieces we're already down to a 38 now so it's going to go very very quickly we've got about 25 people on the lines it's almost over folks call that number at the top of the screen 0901 201 2011 before we finish over, let me tell you about the uh, next lot We've got coming up Egyptian cotton towels. Now, I've got to tell you, I've got a couple of emails. Uh, first of all, somebody said to me, you're the new boy on the block, tell us about yourself. I will, I will, I'll tell you about myself. Uh, I actually, I began in entertainment when I was just a wee wee kid. I was in Oliver for a couple of years in London. Then I went to do mime, and then eventually I ended up on the cruise ships. I spent 20 years at sea, singing, dancing, having a great, great time, became head of entertainment. But I get married next year, folks, so I had to come on land, and I got on land, I said, what am I gonna do? I wanna work in telly. So I looked on telly, I flicked through all the channels, I wanted to give something back to the community. And then I saw Bid TV, and Bid TV was saving people money. I said, what could be better? I could be on television, and I can do the community a favour. I can save thousands, if not millions of people, money. So I applied and here I am, I got the job. So that's a little bit about me. If you would like to email me, my name is paul.beck, B-E-C-Q-U-E, at bid.tv. Drop me a line in time you like. These folks, these are the Egyptian cotton towels that are coming up. They're going to be the very next bid. We're losing, we're losing time now. We've only got about 12 to go. So if you do want to make a bid <laughs> on the pots and plans, Please do so quickly. Number is it on the screen, 0901 201 2011. Now, Egyptian cotton towels, you've heard before that these are the best cotton that is available to you. Somebody did email me and say, please tell me why it's the best cotton in the world. Very, very simply, that's not bid.tv telling you it's the best cotton. That is an industry standard. It has been decided by the industry that these are best. And the reason for that is because in Egypt, and it's not because the cotton is grown in Egypt, but in Egypt they actually hand-pick the cotton, which is great. Many, many of the countries today mechanically pick it, so that can destroy uh, the material of the fibres. And secondly, Egyptian cotton, the fibre on Egyptian cotton is actually longer than any other cotton. And because it's longer, it actually makes a much stronger fabric. So when you rub it on your body, because these all these little bits are longer, then it actually takes the water off much faster, but it feels so luxurious. And that's the reason why, because the fibres are longer. Okay, a couple of emails to read before we run out. We're running out of time, folks. Look look at that price now. We're down to £28. From £150, we're down to £28. We've only got six pieces to go, so please make a bid. I'm going to read you a couple of star buys here. Here's one from Tracy Singleton of Newmarket. She made a successful uh, bid for Egyptian towels. She said, I am a bid TV addict. In fact, everyone I work with at the bank is also addicted now because of my praise of the bid.tv merchandise. 
I purchased numerous items and the quality is outstanding. One of my best buys is the Egyptian cotton towels. I was so impressed by the quality uh, that I bought two sets of towels and I threw my old ones out. Keep up the good work. You entertain me tremendously. Thank you very much, Tracy. Now, one other one. I think I've got time for one more. Yeah, I've got time for one more. Ruth Hughes from Bristol. She made a successful price drop bid for Star Wars Lego set. She's got a great story here. It says, I was a successful bidder for the Star Wars Lego. It is fantastic. My son is a Lego and Star Wars uh, freak. He loves that stuff. The average price for each set in the shops is six pounds. I picked up 10 boxes for a bargain. It just cost me uh, £18 for 10 sets. Uh, they're now being used as rewards for my son's good behaviour. Congratulations. Thank you for writing in to us, Ruth. So, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we've only got a couple to go now. If you would like to get in, we're, in fact, you're going to run out. I don't think you're going to make it. We've only got two to go. Come on, hit that one. Hit the one. Hit the one. The one is going. It's going. It's gone. Folks, uh, we're going to be back. Congratulations to you all. You just paid £19 for the Miracle Made Pots and Pans. Coming up next, we've got the Egyptian cotton towels. Right.